Hello or something, my friends with iPhones. All right, so they can't clone your iPhone, but what they can do is they can use something called AirDroid, and they have to be close to you to do it. They can actually turn your Bluetooth and your Wi-Fi on remotely, but they have to get your passcode first. So don't make your passcode something that's obvious, all right? And ask your pendulums often if you should change it. Keep checking, slide down to your control center every like so often and check to make sure your Wi-Fi and your Bluetooth are still turned off. Because some of you don't realize that it's being turned on without your knowledge because we're, we don't check that stuff, you know? This is like another way that they're trying to get into iPhones now because they're really difficult to get into and they can't be cloned. But this is the way they're doing it now. So I just want to tell you guys what I'm learning. Because we have an entire planet full of toxic men who have joined together different gang members. And this is just their agenda, period. Okay? I mean, it's a, it's a mix of toxic men. And they get into relationships with women. Some of them don't even get, they don't even take the time to get to know you, bitch. Okay? Some of them just, you're their target. And they could say that they marry you. They can marry you without your consent, depending on judges and lawyers and all kinds of stuff. And you would have no idea that this is even going on. But I mean, my main reason was to tell you guys about the iPhone. Okay, It's much more secure than an Android, but they can still do this from AirDroid. All right. So I just wanted to let you guys know this. Constantly check your control center to make sure your Wi-Fi and your Bluetooth are turned off because that's something they can actually do remotely once they get in your phone. Uh, we're not going nowhere. That's always going to remain the same. Out.